Penn State Nittany Lions serving for their first NCAA title ever. That Detmer, she hit it off, and the East has risen. Penn State wins its first NCAA title ever. My time at Penn State was amazing. The pride of being on the 99 team is one that, you know, such great memories, great friends. It was a team that was different. We had, you know, a bunch of different characters on the team, but pulled together and, and did everything we could to be successful. Coach Rose was a huge factor in me going to Penn State. He's a Chicago guy, I'm a Chicago girl, and I liked how he told it to you straight. He was really tough and aggressive but also so caring. He let us be athletic and be who we were. And so I, I really appreciate that and, and take that with me today. Here comes Schumacher and Big Shoe puts it through. Schumacher and she gets it. Katie Schumacher. I graduated Penn State and then I went to grad school at University of Illinois Chicago where I was an assistant coach there and then a head coach eventually for eight years and then was asked to come back to Penn State. My decision to come back was, hey, I love Penn State. Uh, I loved my time there and be able to work with my former coach was something that, you know, I, I couldn't pass that up. When I found out I was head coach, it was super exciting. First, I was like, whoa, is this real? I'm grateful for this, this opportunity. I'm so happy to be back in State College and I love the university, it's a special place. I would love these girls to experience winning the big one because it's really special. Not too many people can say that they've done that, but it's going to take a lot of effort to get back to the top. It's going to take a lot of focus on everyone's part, and it's going to take these 17 women being great teammates. We have eight newcomers, nine returners, so we have a lot of work to do. I think they have some pretty lofty goals, and I want to do my very best to help them achieve that.